dig in. If someone says dig in, they are telling you to start eating, and if you are digging in, you are eating hungrily, heartily, with gusto. Another equally possible meaning for dig in is to be stubborn, resolute, unwavering, such as dig in your heels or dig your toes in. Dig in, guys. You must be hungry after a long day of playing outside, a parent might say to their kids once lunch is on the table. Maybe your partner is famished. Are you going to come eat? I'm digging in. I can't wait any longer. If I tell him he's wrong, he's going to dig in his heels. A friend might be asking your advice on how to deal with her stubborn husband. As you can see, if you dig in or are digging in, you start or continue eating, usually zealously, ravenously, greedily. Or perhaps you're simply entrenching yourself to a certain position or point of view, being stubborn, unwavering, headstrong. The origin of the idiom dig in as it relates to eating is unclear, but it's probably a metaphor. It's easy to make the connection between a shovel digging in dirt and a spoon digging into a pile of food. As for dig your heels in or dig in your toes, they are also a metaphor. You can imagine using your heels or toes to gain leverage in a game of tug-of-war, or if you're a cowboy, wrestling steer. If you're starving, it's quite acceptable to dig in, but if you're presented with information that contradicts your position on a certain matter, it's probably not beneficial to dig in your heels. I'm just going to dig into the leftovers. I haven't eaten all day, your roommate might say a few hours before dinner. Perhaps you're picking up your kids from your parents' place. They'll be ready to go soon. They're just digging into a snack we made for them. I'm digging my toes in. I just know I'm right. Your partner might stubbornly, obstinately insist on maintaining her opinion. So, the next time you want to tell others to start eating, say, dig in. But if you want to describe someone who is being adamant, unyielding, say that they've dug their heels in.